Tell him again. You forgot to put it on. And I did. Again. I did. I forgot to put on. Do not disturb again. Hi. My neighbor called for an egg. I'm waiting for your video to pop up because it hasn't come up yet. Okay. Um, okay, there it is. You gave it to her already? I well, I put it in a Ziploc bag and stuck it on the thing because I oh. didn't want to stand out there and talk to her for three years. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's raining. <laughs> I'm being honest. No, my neighbor called. She she is cooking and needed an egg, and I forgot to put my phone on Do Not Disturb just, again. Yeah. No, so hopefully nobody calls me. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Thanks for coming back. <laughs> Take two. Oh my goodness. I'm just waiting for a few more people to pop in. I had 316 people in here. Oh my goodness. Hi, Christy. <laughs> yeah, an egg. Yeah, yep, she got the egg. <laughs> My daughter does not look amused. She's like this. I have more stuff to give away. <laughs> Did I throw it at her? No. <laughs> Um, somebody called me, Jerry, and when they do that, it interrupts the stream. Um, my neighbor called me to borrow an egg, so I had to start all over again. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up button, guys. You and Katie want to be wrenched? All right. Hang on, where'd you go, Katie? Get over here. All right. You're wrenched. Deanna said, is it on Do Not Disturb Now? No. No, I forgot to do it before I started the stream again. Honestly, you can't even be mad because you do this to yourself I know. every time. I know. I try to remember. I have 15,000 things going on in my head when I'm trying to set up for the sale, and I always forget something. Oh, well, what can I say? Thumbs up, guys. Don't forget thumbs up, please. All right. So, as I was saying, this beautiful teacup <laughs> uh, would be an excellent gift for someone. And it is $10, and it's number 18. $10. Number 18. Nancy Robertson. Nancy Robertson. Wow, my chat's really behind. Nancy Robertson? Yeah. Um, I had... Are you in live chat? Oh, let me check. Let me check. I have Melanie. Oh, uh, wait a minute. No, Melanie said number she three. Had, right, Melanie had the wrong number. Okay. Mind your business, I just mind your business. <laughs> <laughs> well, all righty then. <laughs> Nothing happened. Just mm -hmm. D had to hatch an egg for the neighbor. <laughs> <laughs> All righty. <laughs> um, uh, you know what? I kept trying to end the stream so I could start another one, and it wouldn't let me. 
Anyways. Okay, Lynn, how this works is, um, I'll do a, I'll do a brief synopsis. Go ahead. Okay, there's items that she's going to show. Example A, each item has a number. If you like the item, you type the number. The first person that we see on our end who has the number typed correctly wins the item. So at the end, you're then going to email her, aka my mother, <laughs> uh, all of your information, shipping, <clears throat> PayPal, email address. Uh, mailing your, address. Mailing address. Your name. Your name, if it's not exactly what it is on YouTube. And then she will box everything up and she will send you an invoice with the total shipping. cost, including the shipping. Because each item is priced for just what the item is, not for where it's going. Hello, Sherry. I will, I will tell you what number it is. I will give you a price and then I will tell you the number. So here we go. I'll show you. All right. So next I have this beautiful winter berry. It's a candy box. It is brand new in the box. It's actually a box within a box. Yes, shop girl. Somebody did win the teacup. Yes. So this is what it looks like. I had a hard time getting Whoa. this out during my video. I got it. Okay. So this is it. It's beautiful. And it's called a candy box. And here is, this is from 2009. Really pretty piece. So this is going to be $10, number 51. So, $10, number 51. So now in this instance, as soon as you see the number or hear the number, you type in said number. We have Jerry Ellsworth. Jerry Ellsworth gets number 51. Thank you, Jerry. All right. Next I have... Um, hold on a second. Angela, the teacup was... $10? For, I, don't know, I, think I think it was $10. It was either $10 or $12. So $10. I don't, I don't... Yeah. It was $10. $10. $10. Um, okay. Next I have a set of three ornaments. Ooh. Sound. These are all like porcelain. Uh, well, one of them has batteries. This one. Um, they all work. I had batteries in all three of them. And I they all work. And they all light up, as you can see. Beautiful. Those are some big balls. <laughs> Yes, they are. And they're heavy, too. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> so, you will get the set of three for $15, and they are number 27. The set of three, $15, number 27. Oh, there's different settings. Yeah, there's different settings, too, on the bottom. Elizabeth Gove. This one is just a clear bulb. And then the other one will do where it changes to different colors. Multicolored. Multicolored. Very cool, right? I like the teal. All right, there you go, Elizabeth. It's on the floor here. Uh, that's fine. You want to stay on there? Do you want to put these on your finger and carry them, or no? Oh, gee, okay. Got them? Okay. <laughs> All righty. I have another homemade ceramic piece. This is so cute. She reminds me of the deer in Rudolph, his girlfriend, Clarice. 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 
Look at her. She is too cute. And she's made to look like she's quilted. Um, there are no um, chips or cracks, no signatures. There's no mold uh, name on it. But they're just, she's just so cute. I love her. And she is $6, number 39. $6, number 39. Vintage Made Easy. Vintage Made Easy. Thank you. So anybody that's new here that has never bought from me before, please uh, email me your information. Okay, next I have another uh, homemade ceramic piece. This is from 1987, and it was made by someone named Linda. And it's this very cool wreath taper candle holder. How cute is that? Trying to get you to, so you could see the signature. Where is it? Oh, right here. Linda. 1980. We're up, there it is on the other side. But... It's in excellent condition, no cracks, no chips. It's $8 and it's number 26. Eight bucks, number 26. Everybody's lagging? Well, um, no, the one girl was lagging, so she's leaving. Oh, Linda Dickerhoff wants number 26. That just came up. Yeah. Hey, handsome Nate. How are you, Nate? Check the deer. What's wrong with the deer? Oh, to see if there was any thing on it. No, there's nothing on it. There's no markings or anything on it. I know, uh, uh, Someone anonymously painted it. Yeah. Well, not only that, but, um, oh, she put the number in before Melissa. Uh, the deer was number 39. Wait, what? She said she had the number first. Number 39. Make sure that you're in live I chat. Got vintage made easy. No, vintage made easy. Make sure that you are in live chat and not top chat. And because you will always appear, appear first. first on your end. It goes by who's first on our end. All right. Next, I have a set of vintage... Um, Angel ornaments. These are pretty old. These are made in Hong Kong. And it's these two right here. Now, the only issue is this little guy lost his wings. But you won't see them if they're hanging this way. And they're so pretty. I already have a set or I would keep them. So these are going to be $6, and they're number 16. $6, number 16 for the Hong Kong Choir Boys. Elizabeth Gove. Elizabeth Gove, you got them. I want to make sure I'm in top chat, are you, or I mean live chat. Are you in live chat, Jess? I'm just double checking because because you're lagging. I'm not lagging. You are. My their people are popping up before you're getting them. Who, I'm just who saying. Just popped up, I know. Uh, Tammy Vintage Tidbits or Soul Nate talking to Tammy Vintage Tidbits. 
Oh, yeah? Well, how come when Elizabeth Gove won those, I seen it way before you did? Well, I'm in live chat. So. Well, I'm in live chat. <laughs> All right. I have a pair of salt and pepper shakers. How cute are these guys? He's got awful short arms, though. <laughs> he looks like a T-Rex. <laughs> Doesn't he? <laughs> Why are his arms so short? <laughs> oh my goodness. Anyways, I have a set of Snowman T Rex salt and pepper shakers. They're $8, number 34. <laughs> $8, number 34. <laughs> uh, Myrna Sprat. Myrna, you got the T Rex. Salt and pepper shakers. <laughs> oh, my word. All right, it's time for another giveaway. Time for another giveaway. All right, so we have 115 names down. I am going to do another generate. And the item will be... This little guy right here. He's got the thing on this. Oh, he's got the little patch on his foot, too. I thrifted him uh, new with tags, but he needed to be washed. So the tag was removed and so he could be washed. All right. I'm going to generate a number. Let's see who we get. Number five. Let me show you guys. Number five. Uh, dandelion, dandelion. What's the, what's the rest of it? Dandelion, dandelion in, in the desert, something or other. Dandelion desert. Da there she is, dandelion in a desert rose. Yeah. You are the winner of Pooh Bear. Yay! <laughs> All right. There we go. Congratulations. All righty. Wow, I still got a lot of stuff to go. I'm going to do an offer up, guys. You guys are going to remember this next offer up item. So, uh, for any of you that don't know how the offer up works, I'm going to show you an item and I'm going to give you a starting price. You'll have one minute to enter your offer in $1 increments into the chat. After one minute is up, my daughter will type stop in the chat. Whoever has the highest offer above the word stop will get the item. Whoop, Binks is back again. Can you tell? <laughs> All right. So, uh, I'm going to have, uh, what's her name over there do it? Because I have my number generator on. All right, everybody. Right get your fingers ready. Um, This is the item. Oh. Oh, it's strapped in. Yeah, they're oh my strapped God. I was in. Like, what are you doing? She thought they were all gonna fall out. <laughs> this uh, this is a brand new set of nativity figures made in Hong Kong. Binks in here, buddy. Come sit here. Come no, here. Binks is not up for auction. <laughs> okay, you sit here, trouble. Um, so. This was another one of the items that uh, never went through the sale, didn't go through. So, it's a whole set, brand new, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve pieces. Twelve pieces in the set. No, it's not Fontanini. It's just made in Hong Kong. All right, 
We are going to start the auction. Banks, enough now. Get down. You're pissing me off now. Pardon me. Um, we're going to start the offers at $15. Alexa, start a timer for one minute and 30 seconds. One minute and 30, minute and 30 seconds. seconds, starting now. Start. Because of the lag. So I give them a little extra time. Oh. All right. This is a gorgeous set. These are in perfect condition, brand new. I don't know how much time is left, so <laughs> that's the whole thing with using her. I mean, you could still use your iPad. You just have to pull yeah, it whatever you do. I know. I'll do it next time. <laughs> Everybody's Alexa started Whoops. a timer. What's that? Everybody's Alexa started a timer. So far, we have uh, Vintage Made Easy at 35. I don't know how much time is left. Alexa, how much time is left? You have 10 seconds. 10 left seconds. And 30 second timer. 10 seconds. All right. Alexa, Alexa. stop. Sorry. <laughs> Okay, we're going to refresh so we can see who won. Um, I got Vintage Made Easy for 60 doll hairs. Vintage Made Easy for $60. Congratulations. <laughs> Carrie wants to get the cowbell as her ringtone. <laughs> That would scare the crap out of somebody if you were out in Walmart. <laughs> that would be hilarious. <laughs> oh, dear. All right. Okay, next I have, I love, love, love this ornament. It's brand new in the box. I have to open it from the other end to show you. <laughs> Talk about bling. Look at these two. Isn't that adorable? Linda's a hundred dollars for Binks. This is just amazing. I love it. Oh my gosh. If nobody buys it, I am keeping it. This adorable ornament is eight dollars number fifty four. Eight dollars number fifty four. Is it glass? Ah, uh, I think so. Jeffrey Ross. No, it might be plastic. It might be plastic. All right, you got it, Jeffrey. There it is. It's so cute. I just love it. And here it is in the box. All right. Okay, next I have a vintage Christmas corsage. Um, it's vintage. Uh, I don't know how vintage it is. 
Why does it have freaking... Those uh, look like those things that are in the ocean that were like detonators. No. Those, yes, they do. No, they're those are those things. They're weeds. They're a uh, thistle or some, some kind of thistle. I mean, it looks like one of those ocean bombs. Tell me... <laughs> Tell me this is a cute ocean bombs. Yeah, one of those, like, spiky things that, you know, back in the, the, with the submarines and stuff. I'm back, Pamela! Some My neighbor called me to borrow an egg, and I forgot to put my phone on Do Not Disturb again. Anywho, this is an awesome vintage corsage. It is $10. The landmine corsage. Number 37. Everybody agrees with me. It's the landmine corsage. Ocean bomb. Okay, whatever. Myrna Spratt. Myrna Spratt. You got it, Myrna. Hello, sir. No, he's mad at you. you he's mad him. at me. Look, guys. What's the matter, Binksy? What's the matter, Bob? Huh? Oh, see, he's real. He's mad at me because I yelled at him. Oh. Don't be mad there, Binksy. <laughs> oh. Anywho. <laughs> Okay, next I have this awesome party light. It's a set. It is, look at these penguins, you guys. How cute. Look at how fat they are. They look like they just ate a ton of fish and have passed out. That was definitely a side eye from my cat. Holy crap. Poor I'm waiting for him to stab me with his claw. <laughs> Isn't this adorable? Oh my gosh. Um, I, sh I don't have a candle handy to put in here or I would for you guys. But anyways, this is 12 bucks and it is number 58. $12, number 58. <laughs> They're so cute. I have one. I got one last year for myself. Melissa Heltzley. I'll break that in a second. Melissa, you got it. Uh-oh, she dropped something. All right. Hi, Debbie Vitale. I used to have a boyfriend whose last name was Vitaly. That's cool. All right. Hey, Poodle, I didn't even see you come in. She been in here. I didn't see her. I have your your uh, your plastics put aside, okay? <laughs> Next, I have um, this really nice Christmas creamer with the underplate. Very pretty set. Uh, oh, it is only for decorative decorative purposes only. Not food safe. So I guess you could put a bottle brush tree in there, an air plant, some florals, whatever you would like. And this is, let me get the tag. This is $8 and it's number 50. $8, number 50. That would look cute with a bottle brush tree, I think. Linda Dickerhoff. Okay, Linda, you got it. All right, guys. Wait till you see these. Oh, 
Yes, I have a set of two vintage honeycomb. It's a snowman and Santa Claus. And <laughs> how stinking cute. There's the snowman. And the Santa Claus is sealed in the bag, so I'm not going to open him. Slip it to the huh. Yeah. But that's what he looks like. I did show him that side already. So you get both of these amazing vintage cuties for $12, number 45. $12, number 45. <laughs> Carmen Zermino. <laughs> Carmen, you got him. All right, there we go. All right, next I have, this is really a cute piece. You could do a lot of things with this as far as decorating. Um, this is actually to put plants in because it has a plastic, look at this. It looks like a little vintage toolbox or Christmas toolbox, I mean, but it has this plastic liner in here. If you wanted to put plants, you could put a couple poinsettia plants in here. You could put add a bow on here, decorate it up. It's really, really cute. Some old milk bottles. It looks like yep. a milk crate thing. Yeah, you could put milk bottles in here, whatever. Presents. It's $12 and it's number 30. Whoops. <laughs> $12 number 30 for the basket. <laughs> Linda. Okay, Linda, you got it. Is Jackie still here? This is going to be a long sale because I got a lot of stuff. This is the end of all of my Christmas stuff, you guys. I'm trying to put my offer up items over here. Jackie, Jackie, Jackie. Buffering. Uh oh. I don't know. You're not buffering to me. I'm not buffering on my end. Virginia's buffering, so not, Nate's not buffering, Deanna's not buffering. Okay, well, let's move along. Next I have, I just think this is really cute. This uh, brand new oven mitt. It's got the red car with the tree in the back. Just a really nice piece. It is brand new. It's six dollars, number fifty-nine. Six dollars, number fifty-nine. Tammy Vintage Tidbits. You got it, Tammy. All right. Are y'all ready for some Pottery Barn? Yes, indeed. I have had these listed on eBay, and they're not moving. Um, they do sell for a good price. So I'm selling them for a lot less than they sell on eBay, like $15 to $20 less. So it is a set. These are Pottery Barn. These originally sold for $59.50. And it is a set of luncheon plates with Santa Claus on them. And they're all different. So there's this one. This one. Cookies and milk. Yep. Looks like a Chips Ahoy to me. They're hard to get out. Hang on. 
going China shop. No, I'm not. This one, he's going down the chimney. And this one. And they're all in excellent condition. There are no chips or cracks or anything on any of the plates. So you get the whole set, $30, number 28. $30, number 28. Aren't they nice? They're very pretty. Uh, 28 you said yep vintage made easy vintage made easy you are the winner of the pottery barn plates thank you very much they're really really nice plates so you'll you'll really like those got it all right um I have a cute little vintage thing here. This is a vintage, it's a little magnetic music box. And Mr. and Mrs. Santa are supposed to spin around on here. There's a magnet underneath. You can see that's glass, which is dirty. <laughs> um... I guess she only does the two-step. <laughs> well, yeah, it's got to be on a flat surface. But this is an oldie but goodie. Um, this is made in Hong Kong. So, you know, that's uh, an oldie. <laughs> Anyways, it's $10 and it's number two. $10, number two. <laughs> Mrs. Santa seems to do the spinning. Santa's like slacking. He's not doing anything. <laughs> All right. Uh, I think Lily's, Lily's mom. Lily's mom. You got it. <laughs> it's going to finish playing. All right, another vintage item here. Um, so apparently this used to have separators, uh, clear colored separators. And over the years, they must have like lost some of them. But it is this vintage plastic tree. And I have all these little mercury glass um ornaments that you hang in the little holes on the end so what they i know they put i'm getting to that so what they did is they put pieces of straw a literal mcdonald's straw yeah in between to separate the tiers of branches because they must have lost the plastic um pieces but what you could do if you wanted to is get some plastic tubing um, actually, I have some plastic tubing. Um, I could cut some pieces. See, if you look under here, you could see the plastic ones here. And then they're here and then here, but then they move to the straws. <laughs> and actually, one of them is still in the wrapper. <laughs> but this is an oldie but goodie. So, and like I said, I have little mercury bead ornaments that can be hung on the ends of the branches. This is going to be $12, number 48. It's called a crystal tree. Thank you. It's a crystal tree. $12, number 48. Jerry Ellsworth. Jerry. All right. You got it, Jerry. I'll see if I can... What I'll do is I'll just send you a piece of tubing and you can you can cut it yourself to how long you want them. 
<laughs> yeah, it's pretty cool. Hey, what's up, Jay? And Dallas, Vin Dallas, oh my gosh, I can't talk today. Dallas City Vintage. All righty, uh, let's see. Okay, next I have, this was another item that um, the sale didn't go through. Um, it is this beautiful basket. It's um, it's stuffed, and it's this gorgeous poinsettia material. It's got little red bows on the sides of the ends of the handles. And it comes with all of this gold fruit. There's apples, pears, and there's grape picks. So you get the basket and all the fruit for $14, number 60. $14, number 60. Uh, Elaine Wallace. Okay, Elaine Wallace. You got it. Oh, uh, let me see. Okay, I have some chalkware for you. And I thought these would be perfect for this time of year for decor. Um, these were in perfect condition until I knocked something off a shelf. And it hit the foot of the one and broke off part of the foot. Uh, which one is it? This one? No, this one. Um, I, I fixed it. I did glue it back together. I can touch that up. But yeah, just the very tip of the foot um, got broken off. But it's the set of angels. And as you can see, they're gold. They have their hangers on the back, and they are, let's see, they're about 11 inches long, so. There's a date on the side. No, nope, the other one. Oh, these are made by Miller Studio, 1968. Wow, I never noticed that. You're welcome. Thanks. 1968. So you get the set for, drum roll please, $12, number 10. $12, number 10. <coughs> All righty. Okay, next I have, this is an awesome piece. Um, this is a gorgeous wooden sleigh. You could put, um, originally I believe this had a floral arrangement in it, but you could do anything with this. I mean, you could put um, wrap, you know, full packages and put it inside. You could put a poinsettia plant in it. You could put um, a, an, a floral arrangement in it. You could put a Santa Claus uh, stuffed animal or something in there. It's really, really nice. Winnie the Pooh, yes. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> he, it is so pretty. So this is, um, let's see how long this is. This is, it's about 13 inches long. It's eight inches wide. And it's about 10 inches tall. So 
You get this awesome sleigh for $12 and it's number 12. 12 for 12. 12 for 12. Oh, sis. All right, you got it, sis. All right, this and this sold. All right, okay. Um, I think I'm going to do another giveaway. All right, so I have another giveaway I'm going to do with the number generator. Uh, the next uh, giveaway is this awesome plush a rabbit from Alice in Wonderland. The white rabbit. The white rabbit. On his butt, he's got the thing. He's got his little patch on there. I want to say this came out for one of the Alice in Wonderland anniversaries. Okay, so he's in perfect condition. <laughs> All right, so we're going to do the number generator to see who will win this. Okay, number 69. Miss Damn Jewelry. Miss Damn Jewelry. Miss Damn Jewelry. Are you here? Oh, no, honey. We're doing a, a giveaway. Uh, number 69 uh, has to be next to your name on the list. Well, I'll give her a second to respond. If not, okay. If the person doesn't respond, regenerate. then I'll regenerate and do it again. Let me set him. Oh my gosh, I have all that stuff too. Don't remind me. <laughs> I have a lot of stuff. All right, just quick enough. Yes, yeah, the the first ten minutes of the of the live sale, we wrote names down of everybody in the chat. So that's how we're doing this. Okay, Which next. I know I have to redo it. I'm going to do another item and then do it. Okay. Next up, I have uh, this. I, I guess it's aluminum. It looks like a coffee filter. Hammercraft. It's this really nice basket, and it has coffee the filter. the pine cone <laughs> and and. Um, Pine needles, uh, branches. This would look really pretty with some greenery in it and some Christmas bulbs or some uh, peppermint candies. My daughter said it looks like a coffee filter. It does. <laughs> yes, it, it, yes, it does. So Is this... Um, no, it just says made in Canada and Hammercraft. This is ten dollars number seven. Ten dollars number seven. No, I think it's aluminum. Carla Salamone. Go out and come back in. Okay. Jessica's going to refresh for a second. I mean, she was first on mine, but it's just really behind. She wants to, because her chat's like lagging, so. All right. Um, let me see. All right. No, we gotta do that. Oh. Okay, so I'm going to number generate again because the person that we did didn't respond, so. Okay, so I'm gonna do another number. Number 101. Shop Girl Star. Shop Girl Star. Shop Girl Star. Are you still here? Might be 0 for 2. <laughs> All right. Jess, come and show some things for a minute because I have to potty. 
I can't hold it. I got a potty. I can't help it. Are you kidding? No. Or you guys can just chat amongst yourselves if you want. Okay, shop girl starts there. Out. Oh, she is? Yes. All right, good. Shop girl star, white rabbit. All right. Uh, I have no business being on the internet right now. Just being honest. She puts me in these not very nice positions. Hello. Um, I'll do this thing, I guess. I don't know. Um, this next item is a poinsettia candle holder thing. I don't really understand this though, but whatever. So either way, so it's like a globe poinsettia little candle holder. You could do like a votive candle holder in like the glass, um, like the little glass jar or just like a little tea light if you wanted to. It comes with this thing to go on top, but like, honestly, I don't really know. It doesn't, it like sits on there, but not very tightly. So this is $8 and it is number six. Oh yeah, it could be for potpourri too. That makes sense. I don't know. Like I said, I don't know what I'm what I'm showing. I'm just showing things. Elizabeth, you won the little potpourri thingamajig. Hold on, I need my paper. Uh, Elizabeth, go. Are you sold something? Yeah, thanks. Well, sorry, I've been drinking too much stuff. <laughs> All right. You know, when Mother Nature calls, you can't hold it when you're older. It's the way it goes. I drank two bottles of this before the sale, so. <laughs> All right. Next is this awesome Santa music box. And I wrote next to it what song it sings. Jackie wants to know who pays the shipping on the giveaways. Um, well, I mean. If you're already buying the item, it would just get included in your box. Right. If you already purchased something, it would be included in your box. But because it is a giveaway, I will pay the shipping. Um, this is made by Sankyo, Japan, and it is a music box. It is bisque, and it plays the Santa with the teddy. I have it written. Oh, there it is. It plays, we wish you a Merry Christmas. This is $10, and it's number 42. $10, number 42. He was in my collection, but I don't have room anymore. Elaine oh. Wallace? You want me to? <laughs> you keep cutting me off. <laughs> you got it, Elaine. <laughs> okay. Um, I actually have two more of those, so I'm going to go ahead and show them. This one is Santa in his sleigh. And the music that he sings is, hang on, I have it written. I didn't want to have to wind them up during the sale, so I wrote it down. Um... He's, this one sings, uh, Santa Claus is coming to town. He doesn't sing it, he plays it. <laughs> and this one is, um, I don't see a name on it, but it is also a bisque um, piece. No cracks, no chips. This one is $9 and it's number 14. 
$9, number 14. He hums it. <laughs> Vintage made easy, Jess. You have my paper? Yeah, I know. <laughs> number 14. And my last one, uh, he sing, or he plays oh, Jingle Bells. Jingle Bells, thank you. And he is uh, in his workshop making the toys. Another bisque piece. Now this one was leaning over to the right when you would sit him down. So what I did is I glued this bead on the bottom and now he sits perfectly straight when he's on the table. I don't know why he was leaning, but that seemed to do the trick. Uh, no cracks, no chips. $10, number 17. $10, number 17. <laughs> All right, Lori, you got it. All right. What did you sell this? No? Oh, okay. All right. Next I have this uh, made in Ger Western Germany. This is a little, uh, I call it a weather house. Um, apparently it is supposed to tell you, hang up in an airy place. If weather is dry, turn the chimney till the lady just comes out. Okay. <laughs> um, if it is wet, bring out the man. Only adjust once. And then I guess they're supposed to go in and out as the weather changes, apparently. But I figured, I considered it to be Christmas because it had the Christmas trees here, whatever, you know. So it's $10 and it is number four. $10, number four. You could see that it's made in Germany. Lily's mom. All right, Lily's mom. You got it. All right. Time for another offer up item, guys. All righty. I have another one. Didn't know I had it, but I do. And I think Cheryl won the last one. So this is going to be my next offer up item. Why am I not getting in I am I love chat? Huh? I'm a little confused. I do see oh, her live number, chat. but she's, she's farther down. Um, it's, Melissa, it please make sure, please make sure that you are in live chat. That's what she was trying to say, but it came out as love chat. Oh, okay. That you're in live chat. Now you might have to refresh if you're lagging really bad. A lot of times you have to go in and out. A lot of times it just has to do with the speed of how you type it in. So right. it might be quicker. Yeah. It all depends on your internet also. Sorry. I, I didn't understand that at first but yeah and it all depends on your internet speed as well and you're always going to appear to be first on your end but it's whoever we see on our end so i'm sorry if you're having issues you just refresh yeah just refresh okay all right so this is going to be the next item for the offer up, this vintage Santa and his reindeer. Many people like to put these on their globes so it looks like Santa, you know, flying across the world. So we are going to start this at $10. And you guys will have one minute. Let me just get my, um, my timer. Okay. When uh, Jessica types start, you can start. Ready? Go. <laughs> Starting at ten dollars. He 
He's pretty cool. This is really in great shape, I think. All right, we're coming up on 30 seconds. So far, we have Hello there at 26, Blue Flamingo at 27, Crafty Jackie at 27. <laughs> yeah, it's in really great condition. I mean, they all have their antlers and everything. It's great. Okay, we're coming down on seven seconds. All right, stop. All right, we're going to refresh and see who gets it. Uh, Grace 2 Dana. 0, 1, 0, H. Dana, you got it, girl. Congratulations. Dana. All right. this over here because it's a sold item all right uh let me see okay next i just have this very simple this is a vintage uh ornament hanger box i did put a piece of cellophane in here because it was missing the cellophane and the hooks kept falling out but that's what it looks like. This has been taped. I didn't do that. That was already taped. And this is going to be four bucks, number 32. Four dollars, number 32. Belinda Carroll. Belinda. You got it, Belinda. Uh, I don't know where I put the tag for this. Um, Do I have it on there? What is? What would you have labeled it as? Tree boxes? Yeah, gift boxes. Okay, it's not each. It's just for the yeah. yeah. Okay. okay. Uh, what what's the number? Hmm? Okay. Next, I have. This set of Christmas tree gift boxes, there are boxes inside of here. Um, I can't remember how many, so I'm going to have to undo it. Oh, one. They're all, it's like Russian dolls. Yeah, style. it's like Russian dolls. They're all nested in here. <laughs> I don't think there's one inside of here. There is. is there? I think so. Well, I got to make sure. For it to just be two. I don't know. Let me see. Nope, it's just two. The big one and the medium size one. I don't know why there's not three, but. So it's the set of two Christmas tree boxes. They are $10, number 49. $10, number 49. I'll show you this other one. There's this one. That's the medium size one. Elizabeth goes. All right, Elizabeth, you got them. There we go. Now I got to do this one. <laughs> All righty. Hmm. Um, huh. It's because you got way too much. Money. Yeah, I know. I see that. All right. Shut up, Jess. <laughs> I see you over there shaking your head and rolling your eyeballs. She's like, my mother is a train wreck. All right, there we go. Okay. Uh, let me see. I have this little guy this was somebody's ceramic project from 1977 and it's this little snowman he's a little cutie look how cute he is <laughs> she did a good job 
There it is, 1977. And it was made by Sybil. Okay, $6, number 31. $6, number 31. All right. Cheryl Hoskins. Cheryl Hoskins. All right. Um, so, I don't, I can't remember who bought the Pottery Barn uh, luncheon plates, but I also have this set. This kind of goes, um, this would be a well, real. That one's one of the same pictures. Right. It, it, it's the, one of the pictures that's on the plates. So it is the Santa cup and it says nibble and the saucer. And you can see it says Pottery Barn on there. Okay. So you get the set for $12, number 36. $12, number 36. Vintage Made Easy. Vintage Made Easy. You got the Pottery Barn Cup and Saucer. All right. We're getting there, guys. We're getting there. I do have some, um, uh, I wouldn't say linen items, but non-hard goods. <laughs> All right. Bye, Carrie. Okay. I have here um, some Christmas stockings. Uh, it's a set of four. We have one like this. Cats love Christmas, too. Look how cute that is with the little mice on the top. Then we have this one that says, whoops, wait a minute, the balls are tangled. Hold on there. We have tangled balls. This one that says, Merry Christmas. We have this one. Oh, come on. With the snowmen. Look how cute these are. <laughs> and then this one is Santa. So you get the set of four for $12, number nine. 12 bucks, number nine for four stockings. Elizabeth Gove, I believe. I believe it's you, Elizabeth. I just saw someone here from Germany. Very nice to meet you, Johanna. Thank you very much. You have a Merry Christmas, too. All right. Here is some vintage goodness. All right. <laughs> These are awesome. <laughs> Look at these, you guys. So there is something that used to be on this ladder. I don't know what it was, but it is missing. But, I mean, you could use your imagination and put whatever you would like on there. Too bad you don't have any more of those plastic uh, flower things because that's probably what it was. Oh, maybe. But these are so cool. Look at those flames. And the candles are flocked. They are so, so cool. 
So today you can have the set of two for $12, number 13. $12, number 13 for the set. Grace two zero. Oh, zero Dana. Dana snuck right in there. All right. You got them, Dana. <laughs> All right. Okay, next I have this really pretty crackle glass candle holder. It has the pine cones, berries, and uh, pine leaves on here, or pine, what do you call those? Pine branches, not Sprigs. leaves. Sprigs of Sprigs pine. Sprigs of pine, you know, whatever. And it also comes with a smaller uh, votive. It had two of these with it, uh, but one of the cats broke one, I think. But anyway, so you get this pretty set for $8, number 40. $8, number 40. Elizabeth goes. Elizabeth. You got it, darling. All right. Let me do... Next up, I have... Ooh. Next up, I have a Martha Stewart tree skirt. You know her and Snoop Dogg are like BFFs now? I know. That's Who so would have thought? Martha Stewart and Snoop Dogg? All the pimps in the crib. All the pimps in the crib. She's. That's his song. All the pimps in the crib. Ma. Drop it like it's hot. <laughs> Drop it like it's hot. That is just too funny. I mean, who would have ever thought? Two complete polar opposite people. You know, like, holy crap. That is hilarious to me. I can't stand Martha Stewart. I think she's a snooty biatch myself. But that's just me. But anywho, I like her stuff. And this is a gorgeous tree skirt. It's in perfect condition. It has the quilted underside. I'm glad I'm not the only one. Do you know, I heard that she was really, really mean to her mother. How dare she? You can't say that. You don't know for certain. I said I heard. I know, but you can't say that. I know. Nah, nah, I, can, I heard that she is mean to her mother. And I know she went to jail, so Snoop must have something in common with her. <laughs> Martha probably likes weed. Oh, his weed. Yeah, right? <laughs> Anyways, so that's the back part of it. It's very nicely quilted. And again, this is the front. And it's a beautiful ice blue color. Um, so this is going to be uh, $12, number 61. $12, number 61. The Aging Beginner. The Aging Beginner. You got it. Welcome. You are new to me. I've never seen you at one of my sales before, so welcome. All right. Uh, next, I have uh, a set of handmade placemats. Look how pretty these are. And they have Christmas trees. Can you see the tree design? And then each corner has a snowflake. There are one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten placemats, and they're all in excellent condition. And there are five coasters that go with them. So ten placemats and five coasters. 
And these are going to be, if I could get the tag, $14 and they're number 43. $14, number 43. Happy and Hearn. Yes, he does. I've heard Jeffrey imitate Martha Stewart, and he does He does sound just like her. It's hilarious. <laughs> All right. And my last um, non-hard um, good item is uh, something I previously sold and it didn't get paid for. I had it all wrapped and everything. But it is, let me see if I can just pull out, I'm gonna pull out the picture of it. It is this Charles Dickens throw blanket. It is in perfect condition. Um, you can see what kind of blanket it is. Oh, the hell with it, I'll just pull it out. Why? Well, do you guys really want me to pull it out of the just, of the packaging? The I mean, can you get the idea from the picture? So, even if you opened up, you wouldn't be able to fully put it in. Right, the right. Um, it is a gorgeous blanket. So and good. it is uh, 50 by 68 inches. Triple woven throw. And it is made by Department 56. So, this, um, no, I can't get that back in. Put it in the middle. Whatever. Um, so, the uh, blanket is going to be $20. And I don't know where the tag is. Oh, dear. It should be. I don't know what I did with the tag. Hang on, guys. Oh, here it is. I got it. It's $20, number 56. Hey, Brick House, Brick House Salvage, Steve. $20, number 56. Allie O. Allie O, you're the winner of this gorgeous blanket. This is really beautiful. So you'll be very happy with it. There we go. And it's already packaged nice for you. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's do another giveaway real quick, guys. All righty. Get my number generator up here. Where is it? Uh, right here. All right. So I guess next up, we're going to do... Pumba. <laughs> Hi, Patricia. So this is who we have for our next giveaway. I love Pumba. Timon and Pumba, they were the best. Hey, Alex. All right, so we're going to do a number generator. Okay, it is number 83. Old Stuff Beth TX. Old Stuff Beth, TX. Old Stuff Beth is the winner. Hi, Joanne. Hi, Jen. So, Old Stuff Beth was here, here earlier, so I'll uh, make sure I get that to her. All right. Um, let me see here. Okay, let me get my regular items. I'm going to do this. Um, okay, there's the thing. Okay, next is this awesome, like a burlap reindeer basket. It's got handles on both sides. It's red on the inside. This is like brand new. I only used this for one Christmas season. So, this is going to be uh, $12, number 35. It's good size, too. This is like 14 by 10. Uh, uh, Tammy, 
the Tammy Vintage Tidbits. That's the wrong email address. Yeah, um, make sure you're putting my email address at AOL. Well, hers didn't have, it was just Hazel Eyed Gal. At oh, Verizon. yeah, it's Hazel Eyed Gal 63 at, at AOL.com. AOL right, 35 was Lynn K. Lynn K. All right, you got it, Lynn. I just put the the correct email address in the in the chat. All right, let me put this back on for the rest of the sale. I think I could tolerate it. There we go. All right. Next, I have this vintage. Well, not vintage, but it's to look vintage. Is this awesome? Uh, no happy and harm. Sorry, you were three down. Okay, this awesome, um, this is, this is a, a collection of Santas from around the world. <laughs> Thank you, shop girl. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm choking on my own spit. <coughs> this one is from Ireland. And I will show you what he looks like. Get him out of the box. Um, Lynn wants to ship that reindeer box to her daughter, so she's going to email you. Okay. Address. Yeah, that's fine, Lynn. No problem. So this is the Santa from Ireland. He's gorgeous. Brand new in the box. Still no, never taken out. So this one is going to be... Ooh, get in there. Where did I put this? Oh, here it is. Is that it? No. No? All right. I thought I had the ticket hanging out of it. Mm. Hang on, guys. I'm trying to see what number this is. Unless it was in the box and fell further in when I took them out. Hang on, guys. What would it be called? Um, I don't know. Nope. Well, what the heck did I do with the tag? I don't know. Whatever. Okay, well, what's the last number over there? Oh, no, I could do, I could do the one where I crossed the number out because I took that item out. Yeah, but... Okay. So this is going to be um, $10, number 52. $10, number 52. What do you want me to call it? Irish Santa? Yeah. Elizabeth Gold. What's everybody saying? Oh, no. Who died? A singer. Charlie Pride. Oh, Charlie Pride. Okay. Aw. Charlie Pride. Oh, he got COVID? Oh, dear. Oh, I'll tell you. All right, we're going to do an offer up, everybody. Will we get a Christmas home tour video? Uh, I am planning on it. Uh, probably not till next week, I'm going to say, because... Um, yeah, next week sometime. Okay. Uh, what number was this then? Mm, that was for the tree boxes. Oh, all right. Okay, they fell off, that's all. All right, let me just stick it in here. Okay. All right, we're doing an offer up, folks. Uh, I have a ceramic tree that uh, I'm offering up. This one has the lights. I did sell this last, uh, my last sale. I have it stuffed with bubble wrap. <laughs> um, 
This was made in 1976. Um, and then what you guys could do is uh, you could stick fairy lights up inside of here to make the light bulbs light up. But I do have a stand. I have this stand. It doesn't go to this tree, but you could you could make do with it if you wanted to. So it's up to you. Um, whoever wins this tree, you have to let me know if you want the stand or not. As I said, it doesn't actually go with this tree, but it would give you that option. And you could maybe be glue it, glue it on there, or Cheryl put... said so. The, the person never paid for that one. Nope. Right, right. It's the same person that of all these items. Uh, actually, this is a Miramar mold made in 1957. Uh, the stand is so. We are going to start the offers for this ceramic tree at $20. Everybody ready? Go! Vintage Vinny's having a live sale now, too. I'm running really behind. <laughs> but we're almost done. Yeah, this is a nice tree. There's no cracks, no chips. It's in perfect condition. So we're coming down to 30 seconds, everyone. So far, I see Shirley Pearl at $50. Myrna Spratt at $48. Shop Girl at $51. Shirley Pearl at $52. Oh my goodness, they're coming around the bend. We got 10 seconds left. Shop girl, oh, Myrna at 60. Shop girl, oh, three seconds, two, one, stop. <laughs> Shirley, <laughs> look at Shirley Pearl. <laughs> She could not get the number right. Poor Shirley. Oh, it doesn't matter. She still got I know, it. I know she did. Shirley Pearl, you got it. <laughs> Shirley, Shirley, Shirley. She was killing herself trying to get that 61 in there. That was hilarious. Shirley, do you want the tree stand with it? <laughs> oh, that was funny. <laughs> yes okay you got it <laughs> oh lordy lordy all right i'm gonna set that in there okay uh i have a few more items here i have some vintage um tree toppers they both work, however, one is missing a bulb. Is it this one? No, it isn't. They're all good. Wrong one. I will show you. That's a tree topper? Yeah. Well, actually, no, it's not a tree topper. It's, a, it's to hang in the window. Actually, that's what it is. They, they both are. Uh, I can't find my extension cord. It's all underneath the stuff. Here it is. All right. Here it is. Okay, so now it's not. Oh, there it goes. So this is it. Low battery. Well, one of the lights are out. Yeah. Yeah, this one has a, a light that's out. But it, I believe it blinks, too, once it warms up. Um, this one is, let me show it to you without being lit up. That's what it looks like. So you'll just have to change the one bulb in there. And this one is $8, number 33. 
$8, number 33. It's made to be hung in a window, I believe. Carmen's Amino. Okay, Carmen, you got it. And I just dropped the tag. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> 299 people, and I only have 155 thumbs up. Oh, come on, guys. Help me with the thumbs up. All right, and then I have this one. This one is a. Oh, one of those things just fell off. Oh, put it back on. They fall off all the time. Where did it? Oh, right here. They just snap in place. This one is another one that you hang in your window, and I will plug it in for you. <coughs> That's pretty bright. Holy cow. Whoa. There we go. So this one is eight or ten dollars and it's number twenty. Ten dollars, number twenty. Thank you, Rebecca. Reg searches SATX. All righty. It's my girl Celeste. All right, you got it, Celeste. I'm going to hang this on there. All right. I am going to plug my phone in because I'm on low battery mode here, guys. So excuse me a second. There we go. Okay, next I have, I love this and I don't have any room for it. I'm so mad. Is this adorable snowman plate. He is so cute. He's made by Max Sarah, and he's called Snowfella. But he is adorable. And he is $8, number 46. $8, number 46. Thank you to all of you that uh, Cheryl gave me. Cheryl Haskins. Cheryl Haskins. Thumbs up. I appreciate it. This plate, I think, is just gorgeous. I should keep it because it goes with my Santas in there. Or don't. I know, but I like it. Look, guys, look at this vintage Santa. It's called the Holiday Rider. It's made by Hallmark. And it is the Heirloom Santa Collection. Look how pretty. I love this. Uh, no chips, no cracks. It's $10, number 19. $10, number 19. It's from 1992. Cheryl Hoskins. Cheryl. I know it's going to a good home. All right. Um, okay. These are gorgeous ornaments. I did sell a set of these before. Uh, these are made, I believe, by um, the Bradford Exchange. And it is a set of angel ornaments. These are uh, porcelain with real, like, feathers. And they are all numbered. This one's called the Gentle Guardian. Bye, Chicago lady. Thanks for coming. Then we have this one. This one is called Guardian, Garden Miracle. And this one is called Loving Kindness. Aren't they beautiful? And as I said, they're all numbered and named on the back. And they have their certificate of authenticity. Whoops, wrong way. How do they go? This way? There we go. Uh, the certificate of authenticity, they all come in this 
container. And this set of three is $15, number eight. $15, number eight. Oh, Polly's Projects. Okay, Paula, you got it. All right. Um, I'm going to do a giveaway real quick. We're going to do a giveaway. Um, I have this adorable, what do they call these again? Oh, I don't remember. Oh, there's a name for these. It's a Winnie the uh, Pooh. Ara, ara, do, uh, it's Japanese or something. Ara, Alexa, what's the name of the crochet Japanese characters? Here's something I found on the web. According to crochetconcupiscence.com, if you have spent any time in the world of crochet... And Aragami? Yeah. Yep. That's Amigurumi? Yep, that's it. Okay. It's a Winnie the Pooh Aragurumi or whatever. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> All right. So this is our next giveaway. Okay. I have number 40. Uh... Picasso cat. Picasso cat. Picasso cat. <laughs> Melissa. <laughs> Picasso cat. Is she still here? Yep. There she is. Okay. You got the Winnie the Pooh or Arumagami or whatever it's called. <laughs> All right. All right. So I have one more giveaway thing, and then I have um, two more offer up items. So this is my last regular sale item. And this is the last time I'm going to try to sell this. I've sold it and the person didn't pay. So it is this Dear Santa plate. And apparently this marker, you used to be able to write right on the plate itself. But the marker has since dried up. But it would be an awesome plate for cookies. I mean, it's brand new. It's made by Hallmark. Uh, was never taken out of the box. And it is made by Tabletops Lifestyles. And it's called Dear Santa. It's $12. And it's number 44. $12, number 44. Shop Girl Star. Shop Girl Star. You got it. All right, I am going to do my two last offer ups and then we'll end the sale with a giveaway. So, this is one of two uh, off. Uh, Picasso Cat said that's sweet, but could you give it to someone else? Sure. Would anybody else like well, the. No, you got to do the number generator. Oh, okay. Well, I wasn't I'm just going to. Okay, number 74. Uh, 74. Tammy Christofferson. Tammy Christofferson. Tammy Christofferson is the winner of the Winnie the Pooh. I don't know if she, there she is. Tammy, did you want the poo? If Tammy doesn't want it, I'll just give it to. Well, you, you'll give it a number and do it that way. Yep. Yeah. Sure. Okay. All right. You got it, Tammy. Okay. So th this plug stinks, man. 
I mean, you do have 3,000 things. No, it in. doesn't want to go oh. in all the way. <laughs> this is my next offer up item. Ew. Now, there's a couple bulbs that are burned out. I don't know why. I don't like the blinking thing. One, there's a bulb missing here that has to be replaced. The only ones that are working are the yellow ones. The red and the blues aren't. Yeah, it has bulbs that need to be replaced. But I think it's really, really cool. And this is a pretty, this is pretty vintage. I would say from the 50s. Isn't it awesome? <laughs> um... Right, and you really can't tell with the blinking, but it does need some bulbs replaced. So, we're going to start offers for this at $12. Uh, what is it? Tammy that? said, give poo to Susan, folks. Okay, write it down. Susan wants it, so give it to her. That's okay, I don't mind. Stopwatch. There we go. All right. So, as soon as uh, Jessica types start in the chat, everybody can start. Ready? Go. So, the starting is $12. I see Carla for 15. Lily's mom has 15. Belinda, 25. Shirley Pearl, 26. Blue Flamingo, 27. We got 30 seconds left, guys. Carla Salamone at 30. No, it's not. It's 5.45. Okay. All right. <laughs> we have 10 seconds left, everyone. 10 seconds. Four, three, two, one, stop. All right, we're going to refresh. Carla Salmon, $40. Carla Salamone, you're the winner at $40. You got it. Thank you very much. All right. My last offer up item are these vintage ornaments. What the hell is that? The light from the tree goes in here. Your tree light goes into here and lights up this bottom part. Is that like a, it's supposed to be an army badge or something? No. What do you mean no? There's this one with the star. They're put together with wire. Ma'am. This is the way I got them. There's another one here with the star. And then this one. This one needs a hanger. See, it has a thing where you could slide it onto the tree branch. Those literally look like medallions or something from like an Yeah, army. but that's their ornaments. And you put your lights inside the thing. So there's four of them. There's two like that. And then the two stars. So I'm going to start these at $10 and you'll have one minute. Ready? Nope. nope. Wait, she's not ready. <laughs> ready? Go. Yeah, I think they're really neat. And they look really pretty when you put the light in there. Okay. I got I to gotta put my arm down, guys. My shoulder's killing me. 
I'll just hold it up with one arm. <laughs> Coming down on 30 seconds. Twenty seconds. Ooh. Ten seconds. Did anybody bid? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Stop. Offer. Offer. All right. We will see who got them. You can hear my sleigh bells ring. I am um, old Chris Kringle. Let's see. Just me. Just me. $20. $20. I know. I'm going to, I think I'm going to go after the holidays. I'm going to go talk to my doctor. Um, all right. And. I have three more items uh, to give away, so I'm just going to do all three right in a row. So let me get the number generator going. All right, here we go. Ah! Again. <laughs> all right, number one. Tracy Morgan. Tracy Morgan. Is Tracy Morgan still here? Hmm. I, I've already... Okay, Tracy Morgan. Tracy, here. okay, so you're going to get one of these cute little lanterns. You put a tea light candle in them. All right, so this will be Tracy Morgan's. I'll have to put a, a sticker on it. All right, let's do it again. Oh, number five. Uh, we, we had a number five winner already. Okay, hold on. We already had a number five winner. Okay, number 47. Janet Green. Janet Green? Janet Green. Oh, Denise, honey, um, you don't put numbers in for this. I'm, I'm picking the numbers and giving these away. So the number I picked was 47. So whoever's name is next to 47 gets the item. I don't like her generator i feel like we really haven't did anybody in the, in the well i numbers. that's okay so she's not here i didn't see nothing from her. okay we're gonna do a different number number 112 carol uh powell carol powell are you still here carol hi kathy Kathy Powell. No, Carol. Or Carol Powell. I'm sorry, Kathy. Carol Powell. Okay, Carol or Kathy. No, no Carol. What? what the hell? <laughs> Carol, you won a lantern. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Just Me. <laughs> All right. My and name is Gigi Hall. We have one more lantern. Number 31. Who's number 31? We had a 31 winner. We already. had a 31 winter winter winner already. Number 25. Deborah Jones. Deborah Jones. Deborah Jones, are you in the house? Deborah Jones calling Deborah Jones. You're not Deborah Jones. <laughs> I 
Jessica's falling asleep on the table. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> All right. I'm going to just generate again. Number 18. Grace. Grace. Oh, there's Tracy. Yeah, she. Who is it? Um, Grace Z O. Oh, no, it's Grace 20. Oh, Dana. H. Dana. <laughs> Gina. <laughs> no, <Nope>, Frida. <laughs> Dana, you want a lantern, girl? All right, I know, Dana. <laughs> Dana. <laughs> That's okay. I got Dana's info. So I'll make sure that I send it along with her other oh, stuff. There she is. There she is. All right. <laughs> All right, guys. That's going to do it for this three-hour sale. Holy cow. I hope you guys enjoyed it. <laughs> uh, that'd be it. You're pooped. Oh, my goodness. I'm pooped. Yes, three hours. I started at 3 o'clock. Thanks, Jeffrey. Thanks, Paula, Tammy, everybody. Don't forget to send me your information if you've never bought from me before. All right. I'll catch you guys soon. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs>